Between 1939 and 1945, Finland fought three wars. The Winter War, the Continuation War, and the Lapland War. These were directly linked to World War II. Adolf Hitler from Germany and Joseph Stalin from the Soviet Union, with their ideologies and territorial interests, were the main culprits behind these wars. It was Hitler who initiated the territorial conquests. In March 1938, he annexed Austria, and a year later, in March 1939, he invaded Czechoslovakia. Next was to be Poland. Then, on the 31st of March 1939, the Western powers, England and France, guaranteed Poland's independence. Simultaneously, they began negotiations with the Soviet Union in view of a possible attack by Germany. The talks did not proceed well, because Poland, along with the other Eastern European nations, refused to allow Soviet troops to use their territories in a war against Germany. Hitler took note of this development and, in order to prevent a two-front war, offered Stalin, his worst adversary, a non-aggression pact. Hence, the so-called Molotov-Ribbentrop Pact was signed in Moscow on the 23rd of August, 1939. A secret protocol divided Europe into German and Soviet spheres of influence. The Soviet sphere was to include parts of Poland and Romania, Estonia, Latvia and Finland. It was this pact that made possible for the Soviet Union to move its borders significantly westwards and also advance Stalin's ambition of communist world domination. A month later, the pact was again reviewed, and at that point, Lithuania was brought into the sphere of Soviet influence. Ei se ne perimmäiset syyt se se tuota elokuussa 39 se Hitler ja Stalinin aluejako minkä he he sopivat eihän se ollut tiedossa silloin. Immediately after the pact was signed. On the 1st of September 1939, Germany invaded Poland. Since the Western powers had guaranteed Poland's independence, two days later, they declared war on Germany. So began World War II. Two weeks later, the Soviet Union invaded its claimed share of Poland. At the turn of September, October 1939, the Soviet Union demanded and was granted military bases in Estonia, Latvia and Lithuania. It also signed pacts of mutual assistance with these countries. On the 5th of October 1939, Finland too was invited to negotiate with Moscow. 
The Soviet Union's territorial demands included large land areas in the Karelian Isthmus, a military base in the Hanko Peninsula, and islands in the Gulf of Finland. The ultimate goal of the Soviet Union was the conquest of Finland. This is exactly what happened to the Baltic countries just a short while later. When Finland did not accept all of the demands, the Soviet Union broke off negotiations and began preparing for war. In fact, as early as the mid-1930s, the Soviet Union had already begun to prepare plans for occupying Finland. So, in July 1939, Stalin approved General Maretskov's plan to invade Finland. The main goals of the attack were to cut Finland in half at the latitude of Oulu and to rapidly push through the Karelian Isthmus to Helsinki. Finland was to capitulate in two to three weeks. However, there existed a formal obstacle against launching an attack. The Russo-Finnish Non-Aggression Treaty of 1932, which had in 1934 even been extended to remain in force until 1945. In order to annul the treaty, the Soviet Union set up the so-called Mainala shelling. In other words, it fired an artillery barrage upon its own troops and accused Finland of having done so. By exploiting this blatant lie, the Soviet Union unilaterally abolished the non-aggression treaty and, on the 30th of November, attacked Finland. <laughs> 